Okay, on behalf of uh, Belmont American Legion Post 144, I want to welcome everyone here on this Memorial Day uh, service. It, it, we always, please never forget those who made the ultimate sacrifice so we can gather. So uh, let's always remember, and that's why we're here today. You see before me is actually a continuation of something that was a battlefield necessity during the Civil War due to the need to mark hastily dug graves uh, in a hurry, uh, rifles from those troops was, were used to place over those shallow graves as a marker for the graves details who would come along later and bury those dead and fallen. Third class Donna Hughes. The other members are Cadet Third Class Ash Davis, Cadet Second Class Zach Powell, and Seaman Apprentice Joseph Cunningham. Please stand. So proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming. We call your attention to the small table which occupies a place of dignity and honor. It is set for one, symbolizing the fact that members of our armed forces are missing from our ranks. They are referred to as POWs and MIAs. We call them comrades. They are unable to be with their loved ones and family. So we join together to pay humble tribute to them and to bear witness to the continued absence. I would like to begin by reading a poem entitled The Call. The blood of men flows ever out as raging rivers to the sea. There seems to be an endless source from long lost memory. The young men come to volunteer to, share, to shed their blood once more. They've heard the call to bleed again upon some distant shore. For it's high, high. 